Morning campers. Well, here we are, day four. Starting to look a little grizzly, I must admit. So, uh, had a pretty good night's sleep last night, not too bad. Um, I've got, I'm around 49.5 miles now in. So that would leave me 30, I think it's 83. 80, so it's about 33 miles, 34 miles. Um, to Lordsburg. So I figured I'm going to do this. I'm going to do as many miles as I can today. Like 20-ish, you know, maybe a little over. If, yeah, I'll see how I feel and I'll see what the trail conditions are like. And then what I'm going to do is then that gives me a short day in Lordsburg and then I can get into Lordsburg, hopefully get all my stuff done and uh spend the night and then start off the next day to silver city so we'll see how it goes but uh keep you updated talk to you later bye so, now hey guys so here's what the trail looks like today you know i was just thinking as i was walking along here it's quite a you know i've gone through certainly some different terrain you know a lot of it has been the same but over the last 50 odd miles it's certainly you know different terrain and you know changing all the time it's it's amazing really i wanted to show you that you guys i think that plant there with the stems coming out the top i don't know if it's a yucca plant but from what i can tell when that plant when that cactus um flowers like that it dies i've seen tons of them like that are just keeled over sort of thing so if i find one here close by i'll show it to you see here's a good example of what i was talking about um i'll bet you that one flowered and then they flower and then they just like keel over they almost look like a tree but i've seen them where they're open and they're like hollow inside it's kind of strange well at least different for me this is a wash. Uh, they have a lot of these. They get like, in this part of the country, they get like monsoons. And these things will just be full of water when it rains. But it doesn't stay because it, it's just too dry. Okay, talk to you later. Bye. So I just wanted to show you guys this red sand. It's, um, we haven't had a lot of it, but there's certainly been patches. And it's, it's you know, it's like walk, walking on the beach. It's kind of hard. But uh, look at this. I'll just show you guys this. Those power lines, as far as you can see, all the way, all the way to those hills in the background. Yeah, it just it does remind me of the prairies, but without the hills or mountains. And obviously more vegetation, but flat, very similar. So, I just wanted to show you guys. Thankfully, I don't have to get my water over there, but I'd have to go in there, wrestle those cows. I'm only joking. Wrestle those cows and get my water out of that tank. Where that one cow was just drinking out of. And that's where you get your water sometimes. So far, so good though. Maybe I could get out of that small one with the rock on the top. It's probably cleaner. But yeah. That's uh, that's what you gotta do sometimes. I don't know if you guys will hear me very well, but I just thought I would show you this because you feel pretty small in this vastness. Don't let me tell you. I'm gonna do a 360. Hi guys, so I'll just do a quick video here and I'll let you know what's, what I'm doing. So anyway, I um, I decided, um, I just filled up with water at the, at a, basically a water tank for cattle. And I'm close to Lordsburg, but I have, you know, like probably a good day's hiking. 
I don't, I don't know what the mileage is. I think it's around 16 miles maybe. But anyway, I decided, I'm gonna turn this off. That's my Zolio, it's flashing away there. I decided that, you know what, I'll keep pushing on um, until I get tired um, to Lordsburg. And then that'll make tomorrow a short day um, so then I can, you know, have a good, it's not really a zero day because I'll be hiking tomorrow, but at least I'll get, I'll have lots of time just to do a few bits and pieces in Lordsburg and get ready to get back on the trail um, the next day. So anyway, I just thought before it gets too dark, you can see the, the sun is setting in the back there. It's quite nice, actually. Um, I just thought I'd like, I'm not sure of my mileage. I have no idea, actually. Um, but everything's okay. So that, and I feel okay and I'm not tired and it's really, really windy. I'm, I'm surprised I got a break in the wind, um, which has been good for hiking because you don't get as hot. Um, but anyway, I'm going to keep pressing on and maybe set up camp somewhere and, uh, we'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Good night, everybody.